Siblings with similar interests are rare. But there are siblings who not only share their interests but are also good enough to represent their country in that particular sport. Welcome to Simli Chuma. Today we are counting down the top 10 famous brothers in cricket. Before we get on with the list, we at Simli Chuma make interesting and entertaining videos on cricket and other sports. We used to make non-sports videos as well but now those have been shifted to our new channel Simli Curious. Don't forget to check that out. Number 10. Brett Lee and Shane Lee While they did not play for too long together, they were part of some important Aussie wins. While Brett Lee is considered as one of the legends in fast bowling, Shane Lee is known for his hard batting and medium pace bowling. But he was unable to achieve the success of his younger brother. Shane Lee has represented Australia in 45 matches as opposed to Brett Lee who has made 300 plus international appearances for Australia. Number 9. Dwayne Bravo and Darren Bravo Dwayne and Darren Bravo are half-brothers who represented West Indies in all formats of the game. Dwayne Bravo is one of the most popular cricketers in the world thanks to his charismatic personality. Darren is a good batsman and is playing some good knocks for his country. Dwayne Bravo, who had been the captain of his team in all formats of the game, retired from international cricket as he was not happy with the West Indian cricket politics. But he decided to come back to the team to play the T20 World Cup, which was to happen in 2020 but has now been delayed thanks to the COVID situation. Next on the list are the O'Brien brothers of Ireland. Kevin and Neil O'Brien together represented their national team in the ICC World Cup of 2007, 2011 and 2015. Their father, Brendan O'Brien, is a former professional Irish cricketer. Kevin O'Brien is an extremely experienced all-rounder and is popular for his knock against England in 2011 when he scored the fastest century in World Cup history in just 50 balls. He is also the first Irish cricketer to score a century in Test cricket. Being the elder of the two, Neil is more composed and a focused batsman. Neil has kept the wickets for Ireland throughout his career. He has played more than 176 first-class matches and has scored almost 13,000 runs. At number 7, we have the Chapel brothers, Ian Chapel, Greg Chapel, and Trevor Chapel. When Captain Greg Chapel instructed his younger brother Trevor to bowl underarm to prevent New Zealand's attempt at scoring six runs off the final ball during the ODI in 1981, his elder brother Ian overcame familial bond and condemned the incident on air. However, there was much more to the legacy of the Chapel brothers than that in famous episode. All three brothers played test cricket for Australia with varying degrees of success. When Ian was renowned as a master tactician, Greg established himself as one of the finest batsmen of all time. The duo played together in 43 tests, with the Aussies winning as many as 22 of those matches. On the other hand, Trevor could only manage three appearances in whites. Number 6. Mohinder Amarnath and Surinder Amarnath both Mohinder and Surinder played international cricket for India and were sons of the legendary Lala Amarnath. Surinder was a left-handed batsman who had a lot of experience in domestic cricket. However, he did not get enough opportunities for India as he managed to play only 10 tests, scoring runs at an average of 30.55. On the other hand, Mohinder Amarnath was one of the notable batsmen of his times, representing India in 69 tests and 85 one-day internationals. Number 5. The Morkel Brothers Albie Morkel and Morne Morkel Morkel brothers have represented South African cricket team on various occasions. Albie Morkel was an all-rounder and a big hitter of the cricket ball. He was a pretty productive new ball bowler as well. Albie was also part of CSK's winning team in 2010 and 2011 seasons. Morne was a specialist, right-arm fast medium bowler. He has picked 309 test wickets and is the fifth leading wicket taker for South Africa. Number 4. David Hussey and Mike Hussey Hussey brothers together have played a vital role in the Australian team between 2008 and 2013. Both of them were part of the Australian squad in the ICC World Cup 2011. While Mike Hussey is much more popular worldwide and is termed as Mr. Cricket, David Hussey is extremely popular in the domestic cricket and in T20 circuits all over the world. David Hussey has played 69 one-day internationals for Australia but was unable to play a test match even though he had a 52.26 first-class average, whereas Hussey played 79 tests and 185 ODIs for Australia. 
Number 3 Irfan Pathan and Yusuf Pathan Irfan Pathan and his half brother Yusuf Pathan represented India in One Day Internationals and T20s. Irfan Pathan made a mark picking a hat trick against Pakistan, known for his ability to swing the ball both ways. Irfan Pathan has produced many match winning efforts for India. Both were part of the T20 World Cup winning Indian team. Irfan Pathan has taken 100 wickets and crossed 1000 runs in both tests and one day internationals for India, whereas Yusuf made a special mark in IPL much more than his brother Irfan. At number 2, we have Andy Flower and Grant Flower. The Flower brothers led the foundation for Zimbabwe cricket during their time in the 1990s. Together, both the batsmen have scored 21,608 runs for their nation and were the finest batsmen Zimbabwe has ever produced. Topping our list today, at number 1, we have Steve Waugh and Mark Waugh. This legendary brother duo of Steve and Mark Waugh were the first twin brothers to play an international cricket match together. Mark Waugh was better in ODIs than Steve and Steve was a legend when it came to tests. Between the both of them, they have scored more than 30,000 international runs for Australia. We hope you enjoyed this video. If yes, then please go ahead and hit the like button, share button and we make some highly informative cricket videos. So please don't forget to check them out. And of course, do subscribe to Simbly Chuma.